Hi guys, it's me, Program Marlin, and today we're gonna be playing some Walking Dead. You might have seen me play The Walking Dead with Mr. Puffhead, but now it's just me. So let's go. Let's start off the story. Connecting. Get the full experience. No thanks. Not now. Actually, let's look at the episodes. There's by season a new day, episode one, starved for help, episode two, episode three, long road ahead, episode four, round every corner, episode five, no time left, special episode, 400 days. So we're just gonna get into the game. Stand. Okay, episode one, a new day. So we're gonna start off here. Me and Mr. Puffhead play this game. This game series adapts to the choices you make, the stories tell it, how you play. Yes, I know that. Telltale Games presents. An association with Sky Mountain Entertainment. The Walking Dead. Hi. So, The Walking Dead. Here we go. Episode 1, A New Day. Am I getting arrested? Well, I reckon you didn't do it then. Yeah, I guess. Why do you say that? You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. No. How many? Usually it's about now I get the, I didn't do it. Recon? Every time? Every time. Yeah. Mm. 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 Yep, came up to Atlanta to be a city cop in the 70s. Always wanted to work a murder case. Like that senatorial mess you got yourself mixed up in. With all due respect. A real shame, that is. Hell, the whole family used to be regular at your folks' drugstore right in downtown. Drugstore? Sure is. Damn, this game has drugs also. Any of that seem important to you? All of it, but that box never shuts up. Sit in this seat and pay too much attention and you'll drive yourself crazy. Exactly. I got a nephew up at UGA. <laughs> Do you see okay. a nephew a six year. up in there? You meet your wife in Athens? You want to know That's how a I see big it? Ass time. Sure. He wasn't even speaking, like, what the hell? Sorry if I'm, like, less comedy comedian because it's more than me. You'll have to learn to stop worrying about things you can't control. No police. YouTube video behind this guy. This man once. He, he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. Exactly. He was an older fella. Big, Every soft prisoner would do that. Even I haven't even seen one. I know they would do that. There. 
Said you wasn't here. Crying and snotting all over right where you're sitting. And before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like, like a fussy baby on an airplane. And I tell him he's got to stop. That's government it. property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. It. So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Bruh. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. I'm just going to say man. Man? <laughs> Not even close. They caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. Exactly. It goes the to murderers show would people do that all the time. People mad when they believe their life is over. Recording a YouTube video. Well, I got another good one for head. you. This one's a little bit less depressing and a bit more hilarious if I What's do say so. What's out? This other time. Oh, shit. Yeah, we cried. Holy shit. Dude. Okay, stuff is happening. More shooting and screaming and stuff. Damn, the officer doesn't look right. Why the hell did he have his gun out? Hey! Hey, officer! Are you alright? I'm still cut back here! <sighs> oh, we can kick ourselves out of here. Then do it. Bruh. Damn. Who is up with the officer? Okay, let's go check out on the officer. Darn! Is his leg that bad? Officer! Let's just walk up to him. See what is it? What's happening? He's obviously dead because there's blood. There we go. He's losing. Damn! What in Officer, officer, god damn! 
right through the head also. Damn. Man, exactly. Wait, what's happening? What the hell is happening? What the hell? So welcome to The Walking Dead Season 1. New series. Mr. Puffhead is also doing the series also. Oh god, more zombies. Go. Damn. Go. I know you can do it! Damn, there's zombies everywhere! Damn! Climb up, yeah! Damn! That was, uh... That was a nice start to start off the story. Like that, I'm, I'm starting to like the series so far. Damn, man. Can they break through fences, though? Can they break through fences? Is it a shotgun chain? Or shotgun, I don't know. Someone's shooting. So we're gonna go, we gotta go check out. Hello? Anybody? Okay, let's check out the team. The team sheet? What's that? One of those teacups with some bourbon if I could. Help! Okay, we can come in the house. Can we just get in the house right now? Let's go. Obviously, open the door. Hello? Anybody home? No. Nope. Need a little help. Let's open the door. Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? <laughs> ah, Hello? I'm not an intruder. Or one of them. Okay. Nice drawing. It's a coloring book or something? Yeah, it's a coloring book. Let's go, let's go stay healthy. <clears throat> you might be ruined. <clears throat> Wait, they're fake? Okay, so we're gonna look through stuff in this place. There's a lot to examine. <clears throat> Take the walkie-talkie. You can be maybe it's heading to the police station or something. Yeah, just keep it in your pocket. Nothing. What's that? The Marsh House. That's a Savannah area code. That's where I go, Marshalls. Let's go buy into Marshalls. Let's go to Marshalls, bruh. A cup of water. He sees a cup of water and all he does is just drink it. Bruh. There are three new messages. There are? I never knew that. 
Okay, let's go check out the messages. So let's see. Three new messages. Message one left at 5:43 p.m. Hey Sandra, this is Diana. We're still in Savannah. Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before your spring break. Message two, left at 11.19 p.m. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Marietta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message 3, left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby. If you can hear this, call the police. That's 911. We love you. We love you. Wait, did her parents die? We love you. Did her parents die? Hello. Oh, so it's coming from the walkie-talkie. Hello? You need to be quiet. Ooh, who is this? Who is this? I'm Clementine. This is my house. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. You're not my daddy. No, I'm not. Bruh. We can watch some Netflix. How old are you? How old are you? Eight. And you're all alone? Yes. I don't know where anybody is. How old are you? I'm, uh, 37. Okay. Where are her parents? Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Are you safe? Are you safe? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, my God. Big damn, I would have been both men. Oh, oh, zombie. Damn, again. Oh, oh. Damn. Action's already starting Man. at the beginning of the story. Hi, and my sister's here to talk with you guys also. Did you kill it? I don't know. I think so. Sometimes they come back. Have you killed one? No, but they get shot a lot. All by yourself through this. Yeah, I want my parents Whatever, to my come sister's home not now. Talking. I think that might be a little while, you know. Oh. Look, I don't know what happened. Okay. But I'll look after you till then. What should we do now? We need to find help before it gets dark. Yeah. It's not safe at night. Let's go. Stay close to me. 
Okay. So we're already starting off the story. Pretty good. 20 minutes so far. Walk out of here. She can run. She better wait. Oh, look at those guys. Oh, oh, man, I ain't never getting home to mama at this rate. This sucks. Oh, it's hot dish night. Just open the gate. What's the matter? Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? They won't. We should go. Then they'll find me, right? I won't leave you alone. Hey, man! Holy shit! Don't eat us! We're not gonna hurt you. Yeah. Thought for a second you and the little one were both gonna give us the chop. We need help. Are you trying to get out of here? Because you should be. Those things are all over the damn place. I haven't seen anything as gnarly as this neighborhood exactly. since There's downtown. Exactly, no freaking forest. Back. I'm Sean. Sean Green. This is Clementine. I'm Chet. We shouldn't be out in the open like this. How about you help us clear the way and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. It should be safer there. I'm not a dad. I'm... Her babysitter. Her parents are out of town. Let's get going. Staying put for too long is a mistake. Okay, I guess. What do you want to do? I... Your monster's coming. We gotta go. Leave quick. Let's go. Come on, Puss. Come on, Puss. Okay, so there's like loads of zombies who are chasing us there. So yeah, guys, this looks like a good place to leave it off here. We're gonna resume the game, don't worry. But yes, yeah, so I'm gonna I'm gonna make sure to like on this video, and if you're new around here, subscribe. Also, make sure to go check out Mr. Puffhead's channel, where I've played with him in Walking Dead, also. And also go check out Gaming with Chris or Marlin, our PlayStation gameplay, please. So yeah, hope you guys have a good Christmas and a good weekend. So we'll see you guys like the next time. Bye.